Let's get right to it. The top three cloud providers are Amazon, Microsoft, and Google. No one else is even close. Amazon is called AWS, Microsoft has Azure, and Google shortened to GCP, or Google's cloud platform. The two most used in the real world are Azure and AWS. GCP is a distant third, unless you're a company that's machine learning centric. Then Google is by far the best. Now, this is my real world opinion. I've used all three cloud providers in the real world. Actually, several companies I've worked for used all three cloud providers on different projects. It's important to understand Google is the world leader in applied machine learning, and for that matter, in theoretical machine learning. Google owns DeepMind, and while OpenAI gets a lot of press, they don't play on the same level as DeepMind. Google has taken their AI knowledge and put it into their products, and specifically their cloud products. Google has a top data warehouse on Earth called BigQuery. Snowflake was copied from BigQuery. With BigQuery, you can build end-to-end -end machine learning pipelines using SQL and nothing else. I did a video on this a while back, and I'll put a link in the comments section so you can see it. Google also has AutoML tables. Most of you know that 80% of all real-world machine learning is done on structured data, and that the two most common problems on structured data in the real world are regression and classification. AutoML uses gradient boosters, the top model in the real world on structured data, and then uses deep learning models to find the best hyperparameters. Again, if you aren't familiar, gradient boosters are the top model class on structured data problems, and hyperparameters are knobs in the model you can tweak and tune to make it more accurate. AutoML has been back-tested on almost every Kaggle competition, and it's come in first or second place almost every time. It's been my experience using this product, nothing beats it. While AWS and Azure lead in terms of sheer volume of users, they pale in comparison to GCP in terms of machine learning. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and have a great day. We'll see you soon.